Hey guys, um, I wanted to make a video about what I thought might happen in 2012. I thought it was appropriate since um, New Year's coming up. Um, I'm going to discuss Apple, um, technology in general, Kadian.net, um, maybe even Android. Alright, so the first thing I want to discuss is phones. So, it's not the same story with tablets, and I'll, I'll talk about tablets in a second. But, um, phones right now, with iOS and Android, right? Um, iOS is obviously my preferred choice, um, but Android is a lot of others. Um, and there's something to be said for that. Android is a cheap alternative. Um, a lot of people prefer it. I mean, I personally don't because I'm used to iOS. I find it easier to use. But what I guess what I'm saying is that we've had four years to develop these touchscreen phone technologies. Um, and so basically everything's at that stage where it's personal preference instead of the more developed side. So um, with iOS, they happen to have a head, head start because their advertising stuff is much better. But um, I guess what I'm saying is that Android is not a bad option. I personally do not like it very much, but I understand where people can be coming from. Tablets are a different story because um, the iPad, since it was introduced with with no sort of warning, with it, it, nobody was guessing that something like the iPad was coming out, so they have very little time to prepare what was happening, and the honeycomb tablets and stuff, or whatever it is now, ice cream sandwich. Um, their OS is very undeveloped, especially their app market. I mean, they, they probably have maybe 2,000 apps on their app market. The iPad is 21,000. Additionally, the half million or more iOS, iPhone apps, right? So tablets are a different story. I think iPad will forever be the best tablet. Um, it's thinner, it's lighter, it's faster. It's um, the only thing that I can see competing with the iPad is the Asus EasePad Transformer 2, or whatever it's called, that Asus thing. But I can never look at an Asus without thinking of Walmart crappy cheap computers. Um, my hair's a mess. The um, other thing I would like to talk about is um, Apple. So Apple has obviously taken a big hit with Steve Jobs and stuff, but I think we haven't really had anything big happen lately. I mean, the 4S, but to be honest, the 4S wasn't that big of a shock. I think we're about to have a big something. So something big's about to happen with Apple. Maybe um. Macworld, which I'm reading right now, which is my favorite Mac magazine, is um is saying that there might be a new sort of Apple TV coming out soon. Um, I think that there's something very interesting about to happen, and they're saying that um some they ordered some new touchscreens, some higher resolution touchscreens from Sony for their iPad 2, or iPad 3 at that stage, I guess. Um, Kadian.net. I'm not really sure where I'm going with this because. I realized the other day, Apple is an amazing company, right? They have amazing products, they're very well designed, but they only come out with them every so often. Um, and so, there isn't much to report on with Kadian.net, and so eventually you kind of run out of things, like me. Like, I only manage to make a video maybe every three weeks. Um, so maybe I could do some more sort of Techno Buffalo stuff, but the thing is, you don't want to do something which somebody else is already doing. So I don't know what I should do with KDN.net, but I'm definitely going to keep going. I'm just going to, you know, have a wider spectrum. Um, I mean, there's even another kid my age who is doing something. I bet he's going to watch this, who um, who subscribed to me the other day. He was doing basically the exact same thing as me. Um, with my iPhone 4S video, that's the most views I've ever gotten. I only have something like 1,300 views on it. And that's a lot for me. <laughs> Um, and so I, I'd like, could you please, you know, leave a video response or a comment telling me what you think I should do with, um, Kadian.net. Um, the last thing I was going to talk about is social networking. Social networking is being deeply integrated into these new devices. I mean, even iOS now, which is conservative when it comes to these things, has deep Twitter integration. Um, things like the HTC Cha Cha actually have a dedicated button for Facebook. Um, I personally am a Facebook user. I can never really get into Twitter. Katie.net has a Twitter, but I haven't updated it in, like, ages. I think I forgot the password, actually. I've never gotten into Twitter, but obviously I think that's the way that people are going right now. It's kind of like a live blog. Um, but Facebook, Facebook seriously needs to stop changing. They change, like, every two weeks. And it makes it impossible to get used to. I mean, right now they're actually at a pretty good stage. I, I wish they could just stay, um, stay like they are now. So summarizing, I don't think that much is going to change with Facebook. I hope they stay the same. 
Um, Twitter is obviously gonna. I think I think it's gonna get ahead of of Facebook and the whole social networking thing. I think Kadian.net is gonna move on to something more vast with a wider spectrum. I'm not quite sure yet. And um, I think that iPhones and Androids are kind of going like this. So um, but I do think that the iPad is still way ahead of the game. Alright, see you in my next video.